Well, what I always loved was you got to be a superhero with your friends and you felt strong as a kid watching the Power Rangers. You felt like if you could be in those suits, you could do anything. And uh, that connection in terms of finding your place and belonging and the power that that brings to you as a person is what I wanted to put into this movie and, and, and pull the spirit from that and put it into the movie. I mean, it's humbling, honestly, because you see how they, how excited they are for the movie, how much the brand means to them. They swarm the kids, uh, and I think it reminds us that this movie belongs to them, and we're doing this movie for them, and it, it, it's nice. When I read the very first script, I loved that this was a character journey about five real relatable kids that were all going through something very personal and I thought that that coupled with the backdrop of the spectacle combining those two things was so thrilling and exciting and I think this is such a simple but powerful idea at the heart of the movie which is as these five kids go on their coming of age journey they have to shed their own teenage armor to finally fit into the skins they truly belong in and those skins are the Power Ranger suits. So there's this wonderful metaphor at the heart of the movie and it was there from the very first draft that I read and I thought that was such a exciting and kind of brilliant idea. We got Brian Cranston which I'm thrilled about and proud that we got him in the movie. He obviously has a history with the franchise because he voiced so many of the characters 25 years ago and now he's coming back to play Zordon and is amazing to be our Zordon because he is such a strong just presence and has nobility uh, and uh, a natural sort of quality that feels like he could be their coach and mentor both in a both both to sort of love them but also push them uh, and he has all he brings all of that to the movie. I think they can expect a movie that is going to be a reimagination and a reinvention of what they loved, uh, but he's going to bring it to a more sophisticated, more artistic, uh, contemporary place. Um, and I, I think that they're going to find all the hallmarks that they loved, uh, but it's going to be um, sort of souped up.